Hello, you guys. It's Mouse Beach back for you with the first Let's Play. I'm so excited. We're going to play Ion. Why? Because I want to introduce Ion to you. It's so underrated. What is Ion? Ion is a anime styled MMO open world first person game developed by Gameforge. Yes, it's true. <laughs> developed by Gameforge. Um, I don't want to spoil. You will see what Ion is will be to you. Let's get started. Here you go, select faction. Before we get started, I want you to give something back to me. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to my channel. This helps me enormously. So let's get started, I'm so excited. You can choose between Asmodian's race and Alias race. Read the descriptions. By yourselves I will go on by Elias because the world of the Elias is so much more beautiful than the Asmodian's world is and I want you to see that factor this open world I want you to see it here you go your next <coughs> choice will be selecting a class you can choose between Barriers, Scouts, oh look at the cloud, <laughs> look at the cloud from Final Fantasy, Mages, I mean it's just classic, Priests, Engineers, and Artists. It's my favorite class. So what about all these classes? Various deal physical damage, as you can see in the stats right here and the description below. Scouts as well. Melee damage and range. Mages deal mm, magical damage, of course. Priests as well as they heal. They are more for healing, not for dealing damage. Engineering are dealing physical damage as well. And artists are dealing magical damage. So, if you have a group of friends and you want to team up, I recommend you to go for Varia, Scouts and Priests maybe an engineer as well because these groups are very good for team playing we'll have a priest having your back supporting you healing you up and the various and the scouts dealing damage if you want to go solo like i do go for mage or artists you can also go f with the other classes it's fine remember it will take its time. You will always have to watch your back alone, <laughs> your life. So, I will go solo by artists. I love this class. You will see why. Here you go, creating your character. This is the previous one. On the left side, you can assign your name and check it if it's already taken. Recommended appearances. Made for you. If you're lazy and don't want to build your own character, your own style. Ah, oh, it's so kawaii. Look at that. Yoohoo. Yeah. And creepy. As well, <laughs> I mean, oh my gosh, <laughs> yeah. 
preview shows you how your character will look in clothes. I mean, oh my god, guys, that, that's spooky, look at that. Um, the wings you can achieve in the game. The skills from your class, of course, and emotes. The appearance list selection is for... You can build your own character and save these settings in the account for for example mm, your account got banned or deleted or something happened to it anyways you can build another character and choose the same appearance You see? I've built that already. Ah, oh, it's kawaii. Look at that. Mm. I really want to go by that. Do we go? Yes. Let's do it. Here's another one I've built. It. It's kawaii as well. Okay, back to game. On the right side, you can choose your settings. Okay, maybe you go for the sexy one. Clothing in underwear. So, you can choose its face. From all these faces, guys, from all these faces. And after choosing a face, you can choose the shape. This will influence um, the eyebrows. Let me show you. See what I mean? Eyebrows, makeup. You can choose your skin color, lip color, or your own settings as you can see here on to the next one you will see eye colors left or right side you can choose left side maybe some blue eyes and on the right side um, red or pink you see then the eye shape Eyelashes, of course. Oh, yeah. And the size. Look at that. Bam. You can also choose random. Hell, man, that's creepy. Okay. Go for the hair. Watch the hair. Okay. These are different hairstyles you can choose from. This one, these ones can't be changed, so make sure your face appearance matches your hairstyle or doesn't, like this one. <laughs> um, choose your hair color. You can go very light, medium or very dark. And then from every color, easily. See what I mean? Okay, accessoires as well no. hmm. now you can see it's so kawaii huh. so here you go Facial details, <laughs> that's the fun part. You can choose between a expression. This one is the first, it's none. Your character has none expression. <laughs> it looks funny. She looks like a fishy now. Okay, additional to that, uh, let's go for the fishy one. You can 
choose your own settings more detailed like this holy shit this will be creepy man guys this will be creepy <laughs> oh i love this game look at that So now you've got the perfect monster. Look at that. Well, this <laughs> this is creepy. Don't do that to the Ion world. Guys, don't do that, please. <laughs> I mean, you can go for show. I like trolls. So back to the body details this is the previous appearance we chose from sexy from this one you can choose also between these appearances here you go and then from starting from this one you can Customize it how you want it. Yeah. Yo. So actually, they're all the same. I've just turned from this shape into a bigger shape. So, this one is already customized to look like that, as you saw. So guys, I'm gonna choose my... Already, holy shit, man. she has really thick calves. She's a huge calf, she has really... <laughs> The calves. Hmm. How about? So, here you guys go. This is the final appearance of my character. How about this? Remember, these are just a preview. You will get th those c or some kind of those clothes in the game. In game. You will start with a complete another appearance. So let's get started. Assign a name. Choose your voice. Hello. Can I help you? Ha! Let's end this now. <laughs> what the hell? Take that. Mm-hmm. Don't underestimate me. No, oh, it's kawaii. It reminds me of Padmi's voice from Star Wars so let's check the name out you can use the name okay let's go create character this will be your final choice here you go we did it you can create a huge number of another characters if you want to in your account okay as you can see here, th this will be your starter clothes in Artisk class. Okay, let's get started.
shall await you there, welcoming the storm. It's your destiny. Please, finish this. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Come back to your senses. Did you have a vision? Old Pernus is looking for you. Let's go to the village. Oh my god, guys! This was epic! What? What? Okay, okay, let's get started. Ah, this is your quest. Window. Yeah. This is about the events. This as well. Lightbox missions for everyone who started. Complete 10 quests will be your first quest and then this will be your reward. We can open that later. You will find Luckbox mission here. This is your instant info. About your status. Okay. Hmm. Luna Cube. So the actual events right now is Luna. So for Luna do the quests as well as for Lotbach and you will receive your rewards. Be careful, these rewards might be part of your next mission. Okay. Close it. This is the, sh the, the chat. And here is a small window of your quests. So let's go for walking. Okay. A and D on your keyboard will change your view while V key takes you further and S takes you back. You, I recommend that key shorts to use in PvP fights. Because in PvP fights you need you gotta spell hard. And for your view you can also use right click as you can see. So I recommend you in PvP fights to go for right click and your key. Like the V key, the Y key. Okay. Um, I will be playing on right click and left click. Left click also takes you wherever you want. So both clicks together look like this. Okay, this is your first quest. It's the main story. The main story quests will be golden. Right click to talk to the person and click you through. If you want to read the story, pause the video. So we gotta go to talk to Pernus. Let's see where Pernus will be. This is your map. I always place it here on the bottom. You can change your map into a invincible map. Here you go. Remember the invincible map only shows you ways and where you have to go. It doesn't show you the game graphics. The game graphics will be important. Remember that. Okay, let's go. Find parents. And here he is. I am but a faithful servant. Sir? So after um, finishing, completing your first mission, go with Pernus and talk to him, he is giving you the next one. You can close it. I am but a faithful servant. 
So the next mission is about reading books. Yes, it is. The world of Atreya was created by the god Ion as a paradise where all could live in his abundance. And at the center of the world, he created a tower to house his essence, the magical substance we call Ether. The first of Ion's creatures were the Drakan, whom he created to rule the others. But where once they had governed, they now chose to enslave, taking on new powers and a new name, Valar. Their lords rose in rebellion against Ion. The human race opposed the Valar, but human strength and numbers were not enough to overcome them. Ion imbued certain humans with ether, twelve Empyrean lords to rule the human race, and a host of immortal winged devas. But to prevail against such a foe is no easy task, even for these great warriors. And so the war continued for a thousand years. Israfel, an Empyrean lord, wanted to propose peace to the dragon lords of the Balar. Many disagreed with him, and there were heated debates in the Lord's councils. But when Lady Ariel joined in solidarity, many others followed. They lowered the etheric field that protected them from attack, and the Balar delegation arrived at the tower. In an instant, tragedy struck. Lord Ritra fell. Panic gripped the assembly. Who had attacked first? No one could say. All thoughts of peace abandoned. The war began anew as Lord Phrygion launched a bolt of fire toward Ion's tower. Without the protection of the etheric field, the tower broke apart under the Balar attack. Knowing the danger to humanity in the world, Lady Seal and Lord Israfel rushed to reset the field. Sacrificing themselves, they averted the complete destruction of Atreya, but not in time to prevent a cataclysm that shattered the world into pieces. And so the stage was set for another war that would rule the lives of devas and humans for centuries to come. <gasps> Guys, this was epic. I don't know if you understand me, I'm so into this game. I mean, yeah, yes. <sighs> so, this is the actual note of the book we are reading. Here it shows you the another book you have to read. Let's get it. Okay, here you go. You are very wise now, <laughs> full with, of, if, with experience from. I Atlas. am but a faithful servant. As you can see here, this is the final appearance of your quest. It's it shows you you can finish it. So we will finish it. Here you go. Your and your next mission. Remember, we are doing the main story, the main missions right now. Okay, let's go. What will it be about? Ah, talking to cases. Okay, before we talk to cases, I want you to see this view. Man, guys, look at that. Do you understand now? Okay. Shortcut escape will lead you to the system menu. Here you can quit. Quitting will quit this character, this game. Logout will log you out. Character screen will lock this character out of the world and 
bring you back to your color character list options and cancel cancels just close it options are you can save any settings here really any settings for example the short keys shortcuts mm, yeah. Keep the settings like you wish, like you want to. Um, apply and go for OK. And it closes and you can get started. Here's my list. Let's talk to cases. So, we are actually doing the Guardian exam. It's the first step getting into your class's um, abilities. You gotta do that, you have to do that. It says attack the exam scroll, let's do it. It's simply automatically you attack this scarce crowd until you get a piece of paper from it and while you do that you will level this is only for uh, one to five if you're level 50 you you gotta you don't have to attack the exam scarce crowd because you won't get too much xp from it it's clear so let's talk to cases again You will be asked these questions from the previous videos we have seen. It's um, all about information from the previous um, videos and the book we've read. So let's get The ground on which you are standing is also part of it. Our trier. I maybe have figured out these ones are they they don't count I think I guess they don't count you can um, click any statement here and get to the exam it's, it doesn't count So, open your inventory, you can see the cubes with objects in it, here will be the objects for quests and this will be your inventory you can use for yourself. So let's open this one, I'm, I've opened it by right click, you can double click on it, I don't recommend it. has one minute cooldown so okay and this is your weapons you get all paint rings and stringed instrument you can options here equip modify to fast equip right click so I've changed my weapon now into the instrument and now it's the paint rings Mm, now you can choose between those if you have passed the exam 
you won't. I cannot do that. You will see why. Okay, you have some potions here. Movement, speed potions. And the chest, open the chest. Your first item. You can see by the... You can see... Oh. It's it has better stats. You can see it had as you can see it has better stats than you, the clothes you're wearing right now. So clicking right will like change them. Here you go. And this one is the skill pearl. Deals colorful damage to up six charges in front of you. I always save and spare that for later. You will know why. So let's get started. Here, your skills will be popping up only if you ha can achieve new skills. So this one is for the instrument, for the instrument, and this one is for the old rings. Okay. This shows your passive chains, custom skills. We will see that in the tutorial. This is the tutorial. Let's go for the tutorial. Remember guys, if you're doing a tutorial, get yourself to a safe place. As you can see here. <laughs> He's showing you his skills. That's pretty good. So an iron iron is not much to do, not much to think. You will be guided and lead it with tutorials and figure it out. The missions are about not being very intelligent or clever. They're just obvious and easy. It's just they're made to bring to level up to bring you further in the story and to level up okay let's do it okay so he explained to you this skill bar this will be your shortcuts and this will be your shortcuts I need you to put this out and do your actual fighting skills put your actual fighting skills in this bar on below you will know why it really helps you with pvp fights so, your next mission is... Okay, talking to him. Can't yes, you? speak up. Okay. So the mini-map I've opened you shows you where your next destin destination lies. This game will be a lot of traveling and doing missions. So I will speed the video up for you when traveling. So we have reached the lake. I hope guys you had fun my first tutorial it will improve I'm sure it's just I don't know where to start it's so much <laughs> it's per iron is perfect for let's playing I mean it's look at that guys so I hope you enjoyed it download it it will be a launch and there will be patches to upgrade it because it's online simply 
and you had fun and enjoyed it, got entertained. Let me know what you want to see and see you in the next episode.